to get two applications by twice. Yeah, that's a Somehow integrate Yeah, very much so. Yeah. For Samsung, from a business perspective, like they kind of had a ton of flagship phones in it, you know, with the chip shortage and, and how supply chain problems are now, it just made sense to bring that down to a more reasonable number. Um, and they clearly think there's um, demand for a big phone with a stylus. There are a lot of fans of the Note series who I think will be happy to see that it's sort of living on in a way. That, that is a classic yeah, note. I mean, it's just not... I get my silly old, old school camera. Yeah, that's exactly what we've got. It's going to be a little bit on a Really nice quality, thing. great camera. It is a nice bag, isn't it? I think they've done a phenomenal job. I know, I know. Almost don't want to cover it up with a... I know. ...G died down a little bit over the past couple of years. Yeah, I think it's eased off. And yeah. it's now hopefully, you know, going to... <laughs> so I personally think it looks kind of cool. I'm interested to see if if the lenses protrude a little more. That could kind of like snag on your pocket and maybe not be so great. But I, props to Samsung for just being like, forget the camera bump. <laughs> Yeah, if it was like subscriptions, it's going to be like, yeah, yeah, definitely, definitely. Yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah, yeah, have to admit, those features are cool. I just don't use it. <laughs> it's like, and, and it's like a. Oh, you're taking a picture. Yeah. Oh, yeah, there we go. Yeah. <laughs> um, you know, design wise and. And otherwise, uh, as far as features go, it is really like an iterative update. There's the latest processor, you know, they've refreshed those kind of specs to kind of keep up. Um, but they've talked a little bit about the some of the camera improvements, particularly for low light um, video and um, still photo capture. Uh, they say that you know, night photography will be better um, and that there's um, better depth mapping to kind of help with that portrait mode effect where it can it can identify your subject down to a single hair and cut out um, cut them out and kind of blur the background in a way that's a little more convincing. I think Samsung is really not afraid to put a product out there and kind of see what sticks. I mean, they've done that with the foldable phones and they, you know, kudos to them for really sticking with it and iterating and making a product that is refined enough for a, a mainstream audience. So it could be a case of that, that they're, they're going to, you know, introduce like, here you go. What do you want? You want a massive tablet? You want a regular size tablet? You can have whatever you want. Um, so yeah, it's, it's another case maybe of like, see what sticks. Especially given that halfway through that year, um, 